Welcome back, Pokemon fans. My name is Angel of the Night 091, and we are getting into another battle in the Paldea Prologue. We are getting into battle number 11, and as you guys can see, our rating is now number 13 to 89. We have actually dropped below the 1500, as you guys can see. We are actually getting outplayed by quite a few teams right now. Um, a lot of Trick Room teams, uh, which I should have thought of prior to the competition, but... However, uh, I don't mind losing to good players. That's for sure. Um, it's all about having fun, and as long as you have fun, that's the main thing. So we are going to lead off here with our Maridan. We also are going to be up against a... I'm pretty sure we're going to see his Iron Bundle. So we're going to bring our own Iron Bundle. And then our Mimikyu. And then I think... I'm going to bring our, our Bolivia. Probably is going to go against us with the our Bolivia, but I don't feel like Primeape was going to be the best choice. Dragonite and Shang Pao. I think I'm gonna go for the Terra typing. Uh, we're gonna go for the Terra type onto the Dragonite, and then we're gonna go for the Icy Wind here as well. Um, with the Shane Pow. I think we are going to get it with a Terra Blast the next turn. Okay, Terra typing in with probably Dragonite. I bet he's going in for the normal typing. Yeah, normal Dragonite. Okay, extreme speed, that is going to hurt. Whoa, critical hit one shot. Maybe if I see Dragonite, maybe I should swap out to Mimikyu. There's the Sucker Punch, that actually did a ton of damage. And of course Icy Wind here is not going to worry, or really gonna matter. However, we'll break the multi-scale of the Dragonite. Go for Mimikyu. Okay, we're gonna go for the Protect because obviously he's gonna go for the extreme speed. Perfect. We're going to go with the Play Rough with the Mimikyu because we want to get some damage off onto the Dragonite. And I don't know what Chain Shane Pow is going to do. Throw Chop. It's going to break my disguise. Now, I did already Fairy, did I not? I did. Now, I don't think Shadow Snake is going to outspeed Extreme Speed. I don't think. Yep, there's the extreme speed. Oh my god. Okay, down goes the iron bundle. Sucker punch into the Mimikyu, critical hit. Poor Arbolita. Ugh. My poor little olive tree. Extreme speed's probably gonna knock him out. Ooh, it didn't.
Primate would have been probably the better choice than Arboliva. Yeah. Oh well, guys, you win some, you lose some. You can't win them all. But uh, definitely am enjoying seeing some different teams out here and different combinations. Because quite frankly, when you are in the same kind of battle groups, you see a lot of the same moves, the same plays. Uh, these competitions are great to get better ideas on how to handle your Pokemon, how to get different teams built, and uh, the different move sets that are out there. Like, I'll be honest with you, with that Dragonite set, that's a very common Dragonite set right now. Um, I should have known that it was going to go for the Terra Normal, so I should have brought my two Fairy types for that. Or not my two Fairy, my two Ghost types for that. See, where I could have gone for the Play Rough with the Mimikyu onto the Dragonite, and with the Primate going for the Drain Punch or like, you know, Rage Fist or something, I might have been able to do a bit better in that route because obviously I wouldn't get wrecked by the extreme speeds. Uh, however, with the Throat Chop, with the Shine Pow, it could have proven to be a bit of an issue, especially for the Primate. Um, but the Mimikyu might have still been okay, depending if I had the proper backup for it. But let me know what you guys think. Post your comments. What would you guys have done differently? What Pokemon would you have brought to the battle? Should I have brought Talonflame for the, for the Tailwind? Um, so those are the questions that I have. If you guys, uh, enjoy the battle, <coughs> post your comments, like I said, and, uh, we'll get into the next battle. Take care.